what's a polynomial? Well, that is a really great question. This video is all about polynomials. Let's take a look. Here's an example of a polynomial, 5x squared plus 6y plus 9. Now notice that there are variables, and there's a number all by itself here. Each of these is called a term. There are terms that have variables and exponents. There are terms that just have variables. And there are just numbers. When we have a number like this, it's called a constant. Notice that this exponent is positive. One of the things that makes a polynomial a polynomial is that it has positive integer exponents. A polynomial is an expression with constants, variables, and positive integer exponents. Take a minute to write this down in your notebook. You can also write down an example like this one. 5y squared plus 5y plus 8. This is an example of a polynomial. Here's another one. 15x squared plus 6y minus 1. Both of these are examples of polynomials. Is this a polynomial? Well, let's take a look. First, notice that it has a combination of constants, variables, and positive integer exponents. Here's our constant. It's a 3. And we have two other terms in the polynomial, 5y and 6x squared. This is indeed a polynomial. What about this one? Well, notice right away that this is a negative integer as an exponent. And so as a result, we can say that this is not a polynomial. We can organize polynomials, too. Sometimes you'll get them out of order, and sometimes you'll get them in order. Let's take a look at a polynomial that's in order. 5x cubed plus 2x squared plus 3x minus 4. Now notice that the exponents go in order from largest to smallest. 3, 2, we know this one has a 1, and then the constant is at the end. This is a polynomial in order. Look at this polynomial, 2y plus 2y cubed, plus 6x, plus 1. Can you rearrange this one so that it's in order? Well, first, we're going to put the x's before the y. So we're going to start off with a 6x. Our next largest value is 2y cubed. So plus 2y cubed. Then we have 2y plus 2y. And finally, we put the constant in plus 1. Here's another one that's out of order. 15x minus 3x squared plus 12x cubed plus 19. Let's take the largest one first. We have a positive 12x cubed. That's our first term. Now our next term has this subtraction, or you could think of it as a negative with it. Let's bring that down. We have a positive 15x, and then finally we put our constant in. Now this polynomial is ordered correctly.